Good morning, everyone. It's 855, and I'm CBS News' Vince Gerasoli. Let's get right to meteorologist Megan Glaros for the forecast. Hey, Vince, I am in love with the forecast. Thanks, Megan. In local headlines now, we're following breaking news. A mother is shot in the Pill Hill neighborhood on Chicago's southeast side. It happened just before 11 last night near 93rd and Chappelle. The victim is a 43-year-old woman. She was shot multiple times. Police say the shooter may have known her son, who got into some sort of altercation with someone earlier in the day. They believe that person returned in the evening and shot the mother as she was taking out the garbage. Chelsea Clinton will be in Chicago today visiting the downtown offices of the nonprofit group Feeding America. She'll be discussing childhood hunger. The organization is featured in her new book. A warning if you try to cross railroad tracks when warning gates are down. Metro Police will be issuing citations to violators across the area today. Last year, 79 people were injured or killed near rail crossings here in the state of Illinois. Two Cook County Sheriff's officers who rescued a man from a burning car will be honored today for their heroism. Officers William Hoffler and Victor Yatsik risked their lives last month to pull 18-year-old Joe Richmond from his car seconds before it burst into flames. Now, Great Clips Hair Salon is rewarding the officers with $2,000 for their bravery and service. The officers refused to accept the money for themselves, and they're going to be donating it to a nonprofit that helps the families of fallen Illinois police officers. Well, that's it for us for now, but we've got more news coming your way at 11 o'clock today. Until then, make it a great one.